Hello, welcome back to e Chinese. The word for today is Gui. I believe many of you have known the word Gui as in expensive, but of course Gui carries another other's different meaning, uh, which we will look in depth uh, later. The first one, expensive, Ang Gui in monetary term, Ang Gui. Second meaning of Gui is highly valued, Gao Gui. It means very um, elegant or highly valued in term. If I say, um, so she looks very elegant. Guizhong means highly valued as in, it's not only as in monetary term, it's probably have some um, sentimental value attached to it. We will look into this word in our sentences later. Gao Gui Bu Gui. So, Gao Gui Bu Gui. Gui is actually means that it's highly valued and but it's not expensive. Or we can say that something Gao Gui Bu Gui means that it's look very elegant, very high end, but it's not expensive. Gui Jing Bu Gui Duo. The word Gui here is actually means that value, right? The first Gui, it means Jing is actually means refined. So quad is the quality. So Jing is actually means quality here. So Gui Jing Bu Gui Duo means that means that it's about quality, not about quantity. So the Duo is a lot, right? So Jing is actually means refined. So it's about quality, not about quality quantity. The third meaning of Gui is noble, as in a person. If I say Gui Bing is the honorable guest. So if I say, oh, 今天您是我们的贵宾, means that today you are our honorable guest. 贵宾, 贵族 is like the blue blood, right? So maybe Prince Harry, so it's 贵族, right? 贵族 is the, like the blue, blue blood. 贵人多忘事, 贵人多忘事 here is actually a good natural sarcasm. So which means that 贵人, so normally if I say 您贵人多忘事, so it means that you know you are so important, of course you forgot I would you forgot things, right? So this is actually a good nature sarcasm. So 贵人多忘事, 贵人 here, it means that very important person, right? 人 is just a person, and then 贵 here carries the meaning of important or noble. So 贵人多忘事 means important person, Forget about things, naturally, apparently. So number four is Gui actually has the meanings of yours, but in terms in a courteous way. The Gui Gong Si here. Gui Gong Si Gong Si is actually means company. Gui Gong Si means your company. In a very courteous way to say your company is mean your honorable company. Right, your good company. It's like you know the old English, your good self. So the your good company or your honorable company. Gui Guo is again a very courteous way to say your country. So instead of saying the go ni the guo jia, right? Ni the guo jia is a normal way to say that. Then but this one Gui Guo means that your honorable country. So Gui Guo. And then Gui Xing. Of course, it's, we learned this before. Gui Xing is actually mean that your honorable surname. Xing is surname or last name. And then Gui Quan Zhen Luan. So Gui Quan Zhen Luan, this one is actually just um, very new terms actually. Gui Quan just means your circle. Quan is actually means circle, right? So your social circle, your circle, whatever circle that you are in. Zhen Luan, Luan is messy. So if I say Gui Quan Zhen Luan, even though I use the word Gui Da, it's not a compliment at all. So it's just mean that, oh, you know what, your group of circles, your group of friends, it's very messy. So, you know, uh, it just made me shaking my head. So now let us look at the sentences, some example, how do we use Gui? The first the first meaning of Gui is of course expensive and then the, the first sentence is 
，这手链太昂贵了，我不能要。Let's just compare with the second sentence. 这手链太贵重了，我不能要。You see the sentence. The the sentence is actually exactly the same. The only difference is 昂贵 and 贵重 The first sentence, the word 昂贵 here means expensive. This is just means so 链 is your、uh, bracelet. So this sentence just means the oh this bracelet is so expensive in terms of money. Maybe it's, maybe it's cost billions of dollars or millions of dollars, right? So it's too expensive. And then 我不能要 I can't I can't possibly I can't possible One day you, I don't want it. Like 我不能要 I cannot have it. Right, 我不能要 But in the second sentence, the word 贵重 here, it's not necessarily mean you know means expensive. It just mean it's very it's too important. It's highly valued. You know, the has the family or sentimental value attached to it. So it's too. It's too important or too has too much of sentimental value. So 太贵重了 So I I can't possibly have it. I cannot have it. 我不能要 Number three, 这是贵族学校，一般人进不了。贵族学校，贵族 is actually mean aristocrat, right? So 贵族学校 the school that it has all these aristocrats in in that maybe no. Uh, Princess Charlotte、uh, studied there, so you know you can't go in because you no, know, it's not meant for normal person like us. So, 一般人进不了，一般人进不了，一般人 is just a normal person like us, and then like me, <laughs> 一般人进不了，进不了 is cannot get in. So number four, 我对贵公司的产品非常感兴趣。贵公司 here, remember the word. 公司 is company. 贵公司 your honorable company, your good company. So, 产品 is actually product, and 感兴趣 has interest. So, 我对贵公司的产品非常感兴趣 means that I have a lot of interest towards your good company product. Now, let us let us look at some idioms and also proverbs. 物以稀为贵 So this sentence is actually means scarcity increase the value. So u is actually means things, right? Items. C is scar. So it's very、um, not a lot scar. So u i c wei gui means the things that is scar. It's expensive or it's important. So u i c wei gui. So it can mean that it's highly valued. The gui here can mean literally. Expensive or can mean highly valued. You know, a good talent, it's it's highly valued because it's so hard to get the people that with common sense now. So, so 物以稀为贵 and then 兵贵神速兵贵神速 So 兵 is actually means soldier, right? So 兵贵神速 the word 速 here is actually means speed as well. So 神速 so 兵贵神速 means soldier or in war. Speed is um is paramount. It's very important. So you need to be quick when you are in war. Apparently, so 富贵不能淫富贵 means rich, right? 不能淫淫 is actually means corrupt. So 富贵不能淫 means that even when you are rich. Or you are in a high ranking, it should not be corrupt. 不当家不知柴米贵 So 当家 is actually means being a managing a household. So you are the treasury of the household. You are the master of. You are the boss of the household. So 当家 and then 柴米柴米 is just you know the uh the wood. Tai is actually the wood that you you need to burn the stove. You know, mi is just rice. So, 不知不知 means do not know. So, if you are this sentence actually mean if you are not the head of the household or you if you are not the treasury of the household, 
you would never you would not know how expensive the wood and also the rice is so it's just mean a person who doesn't manage a household wouldn't be aware of how expensive things is next one is ren gui zi zhi ren gui zi zhi so the gui here is actually carries the meaning of highly value so ren gui zi zhi zi zhi just now in the bu zhi is do not know isn't it the bu dang jia bu zhi cai mi gui the bu zhi here is do not know of course zhi here means no so zi is actually derived from the word zi ji means self right zi zhi means you have the self awareness self knowing of something self knowing so you understand uh, zi zhi means that you you understand yourself you know you you understand yourself you know about your ability or what not so ren gui zi zhi means that a person is essential to know their own limits so you have to know about yourself so ren gui zi zhi we will look in depth into this in our sentences later so for example the idioms and proverb sentences zhe xiang shui shi xian liang ban wu yi xi wei gui ma jia qian dang ren ye shao shao gao yi dian er so zhe xiang shui xiang shui is perfume xian liang ban is limited edition wu yi xi wei gui ma so you know scarf things is always expensive so the word ma here is just soften the tone makes it sound more relaxed jia qian the price dang ran of course ye of course also shao shao gao yi dian so shao shao is actually means a little and then yi dian is also mean a little so shao shao gao yi dian means that of course it's a little bit higher so why do i have the shao shao gao yi dian so this one shao shao here is just mean you know it's just tiny little bit higher so the word gao yi dian is higher so the shao shao here again is soften the tone so make this sound you know this this um this sales person will tell you of course this perfume it's a little bit tiny little bit expensive because it's so scale it's so scar right it's you know it's limited editions so she just want to make this sound softer and then the second sentence is ren gui zi zhi wo zi ji zhi dao wo shen me ban de dao shen me ban bu dao so ren gui zi zhi the it actually means that you know a person is highly valued by knowing their own limitations or you know what they can so what their own limitations so this sentence 我自己知道, 自己, 自己, from the is the same as 自知, the 自, right it's the same so 自己 actually means itself 知道 is from the word 知, so it actually means no I myself know 我什么办得到, 办得到 means can do I can achieve 我什么, what I can achieve 什么, 办不到, negative the word 不, that right so what i can't achieve hopefully you have enjoyed this short video and you have learned you have after this video you have a better understanding of the word 贵. please do subscribe share and comment if you find this video useful thank you and i will see you in my next video